Welcome back. Ooh, subtle. Soft. For the bourbon talk. I'm Sean. Uh. <laughs> I feel like there just needs to be a saxophone. I give it like a that. hump, dude. Like, like a table. saxophone in the back. I'm Dan. Careless whisper. And this is a boon. County 1833, aged 12 years, made by ghosts. You know that? I don't know why it says that all over it. Dude, look. It's it does. It is. Stamped into the glass. It's also put on the label. This is a bottle that I wanted for a hot minute now. I got this off Caskers for 90 shift, I believe, at the time. It's so, it's not bad, as long as this is good. This is MGP sourced whiskey mm. from a craft distillery, mm. but it is in the coolest, second coolest, second favorite bottle <laughs> design on the shelf. Wow. After Turkey. Oh, oh really? Master's Keep, yeah. You're gonna throw that in for all the decanters and stuff yeah. too? Wow. Uh, well, right. Old Fitz isn't a bottle, it's a decanter. Okay. Uh, it's still a bottle because it has a cork. It's a bottle? Yep. I mean, we like all the Orphan Vale bottles. Woodford is close. There's this weird tomb-like shape that represents death. Sarcophagus. That's what they call them? Yeah. I think that's esophagus, Sean. Sarcophagus. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna complain right now because they have this nice, like, looking little baby right here that looks like a, a tax stamp over it. It does kind of look like a tax stamp. That it looks like it's gonna stamp. be bottled and mod. It doesn't have the proof on it, though, so it a little bit gives it away. Yeah. Um, Cheers. Okay. Ooh, that was a good one. Solid. Why are you pouring? Why? Oh, I got the shit under control. Wow. Okay. okay How was that ha Oh. <laughs> Just move this nice cloth I've got over here. I'm pouring it over the label, unfortunately, which is actually going to ruin the label. And it's going to be just a minute of excuses here. You still dropped some. You know what? I need a second. This is why I poured. Well, I poured into this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Which ran her down. Add to the minute of excuses here. <laughs> wow. Okay. Say it right now. Say it right now. Right. I'm really excited for this and he's not. Say it right now. Red Rick. 100%. Yeah. Holy smokes. Is that a good this solid sweetness? This is a smack in the face of like a butterscotch caramel. Um, yeah. It's oh good. my gosh, dude. It smells, uh, the smell on that, the nose on that is really, really good. So the last thing you were this excited for yeah. was Old Fitz. And it wasn't good. It was awful. Um, so this you is- You might have the better, better one to be more maybe. excited about. Uh, it's distilled in Indiana, MGP, obviously. Yeah. Um, but it's bottled in Kentucky, uh, Kentucky by Boone County Distilling Co. Um, I believe that you can get that in there, or you could have gotten that at some point in their gift shop in the at the distillery for like quickly like lady. 75 or something like that. Oh, there was 80. Something like that, yeah. yeah. These are way 90 shipped on Caskers is not bad. Not bad. No, no, no. It's, it's not bad if the retail of it is 80. My mm. lord, that is so... I like, tell you what. Woo! We talking top... I, three, four noses Okay, here. so I really want to drink this, but I just want to let it sit here and open up for a, a, just a smidge, see if I can pick a little bit more I don't hate smelling it for the rest of my life. I like the color a lot. It's really, yeah, really cool. Yeah, I just gave it a, ooh. He's going into it. Oh. So, I'm a we, fan. we went over that it was 20-something oh. percent rye. Yeah. I was high rye. Higher rye, yeah. I can really taste it. It's like 75 oh. corn. I mean, that and then it's 23 rye, four, or 22 rye, four barley, something I'll like that. I'll give you that. Yeah, okay. something like that. Okay, I'm just gonna add something to both of ours, but that's cool. I can't give you it's shit. It's spilling, dude. Just, yeah. It must be the bottle design. I think it's got a lip on it that I'm, I can't give a shit anymore about that. It definitely spilled. I spilled a lot. I love Gosh. the label. I absolutely love the label on this. Yeah, it uh... The label's so cool, it stands out, and it, the colors are great because they're not cheaply bright. I mean, well, it's 
blue and orange. It's kind of blue colors. Well, they're, they're like, it's like a teal. That's yeah. like a, a teal, a dark teal. Oh my Man, gosh. Cool. Okay. Uh, I have to do it. You have to compare it, huh? Yeah. All right. You getting the store pickup? No. What are you getting now? Rhetoric? Yeah. Wow, you're, it's that close for you. Yeah, it really is. It. Uh, I you have that in your back pocket? Yeah, because you spilled whiskey all over wow. it. Super nerd, dude. You spilled whiskey all over it. It was sitting <laughs> in front of this, and you were just spilling Boone County all over it. I get some uh, barrel on the palate, and then it goes into like a bittersweet note at the end there. Oh my gosh, it's it's like butter in your mouth too. It is, too. dude. And okay, mouth I rarely great. say this. Ninety proof on this is pretty much perfect. I don't think I want more heat out of this. There's a little, like, so here's the thing is you get some of the spice on the tongue. Yeah. It, it um, sits there and the dances on ride. it. Ooh, yeah. It's, it's good. not offensive and it doesn't make me go, ooh, that's hot. Yeah. There's no heartburn involved in this. What you do a little cat. Hey, small cat. Thumb cat. Come here. Come here. I'm the cat, man. We know this. Hey, Doug Katie. This is who you guys hear a lot. Is this little guy right here? He's got thumbs. Super cool. And we adopted him from a home that we bought. But uh, nope, they don't smell the same. What? Nope, that's toasted caramel. Let me go. Oh. Yeah, that's yeah, toasted caramel. Yeah, it is. Yeah. This is more um. This is more like butterscotch barely. I need to... This is so much more in your face with that with that butterscotch. Yeah. This is not what I remember. I think nice. I think that smells sugar more sugary. Uh -huh. You know, it's got that. <laughs> oh my god! What in the actual? Dude, that was so I did rock you <laughs> at whiskey. Like I don't know where you planned the stop, but I think it was about two inches short, and you were just like. <laughs> I like it a lot, mm -hmm. though. I didn't realize. Ooh, this is I, uh, this is gonna be hard for me to grade. I get brown sugar in the finish, like sweet brown sugar. It um, just sets in. Barrel left. sits in the back, and a little yeah. bit of like the spice sits on the tongue for a little, like a really short period of time. Oh, proof for me. So good. You're yeah. right. The proof it's, is really good. It's really good. So Love for me, the brown paper. sugar. You're right. It sits there. Just in the front of my mouth. Yeah. In the finish, really yeah. heavily. No, that's really that's a uh, huh. That's balanced. This is what you can source. <laughs> huh. That's very interesting. I that I it's really Man. good. It okay. Honestly, it's almost on the edge of too sweet. I'm gonna grade it high. I'm calling it. I'm going to grade this. You about to cry? What's happening? So happy that one finally came through. <laughs> so happy that a bottle of whiskey finally met my expectations. I'm, just, I'm actually really split on a grade right now. It's between two, which obviously means it's a plus minus mm -hmm. situation we got going on here. I, I agree with you, and I bet we're in the exact same ballpark. Yeah, obviously it's B plus A minus, right? Yep, yeah. 100%. Um, um, just be. I'm gonna go a B plus. And here's why I'm gonna give it a B plus. Let me hear it. Because I think a barrel proof it. would make this. I think a barrel proof would make this an a, a straight solid A. I don't know, man. I think it would because you I get so much good flavor out of it. You do. That I don't feel like you're missing anything that barrel proof. Well, I don't know that. I, I don't. That's, I the, don't that's know. the problem. Yeah. I don't We're know both that you're missing anything. We're both but speculating. This is. I think the proof is right. In this bottle, it is. Yeah, it feels like it's it. proofed out right. Never I, had I higher, but for eighty dollars, this is at least as good, if not better, than any Booker's I've ever had for the oh. exact same price. Okay, that's fair. Those are barrel proof. Yeah. This is twice as old. Yeah. This is sourced, and those aren't. You've got a lot of differences here. As it sits right now, it's great. Super good smelling. Great. It has a lot of complexity that I can sit there and I was just smelling it and I'm like, ooh, I, oh, that's good. Oh, I taste it. I'm like, dang, it's nice and sweet. It's rich. The mouthfeel, fantastic. 
It, it, it coats, it sits like butter in there. Like, look at it, cling to that glass. This is a great bourbon. That is solid. And I'll give the A minus because there I are others that. that I would walk in on the shelf. And if I saw that and then, like, for 80. done. For 80, Don't even man. care. If I was going there for something else and that was sitting there for 80 bucks, done. So, Boone County. You did well. You guys knocked a one out of the park. There's a 13 out. I know that. We should probably work on that. Oh, um, right? I think. Besides uh, the 13. Um, there's store picks, there's single barrels, there's stuff like that we don't have. Now, but if you see this, please send me one. We're pretty much buy it. Please send me one, I'll send you money back. <laughs> we're the bourbon junkies. This shit is delicious. I'm Sean. Damn. And uh, the proof is in the pork. It's just. Damn, just going right in. Yeah. Oh. What was that? What? Why'd you add two? That was that. No, it wasn't. Because it was. You added the f***ing rhetoric. You son of a bitch.